Can I go to the sleepover? I want you to promise me something. If there's any drinking, I want you to say, no thanks, not my thing. I promise, Mom. They really do hear you. Did you pack your toothbrush? For tips on how to start the talk, visit underagedrinking.samsa.gov. When a candidate come to me, because I know the community and stuff, they always ask for my help. I was always the one that was in the background, and I was asked by Coleman, would I, because he asked me why he never run, and I told him I never wanted to be a candidate. I love to help. I'm a person that would love to be in the background helping people. Of the candidates that knows me will tell you that I tell them I like to not hear what they're going to do. I like to see what they're going to do. And most of the candidates are wonderful. And my goal is, I am 60. We do need new faces. And we need the young faces. We need to start with them and build them up to be a candidate in their beliefs. So with this committee, that's what I'm, one of the things I want to do, is bring the young ones in. It actually, that's the reason why I'm in the Boston area. Because like I said, I lived in the Boston area. I don't live there now. And even with my age, you could do things, even as people as color in this town. It is very exciting. And it showed the young ones again, hey, it doesn't matter what color you are or anything. As long as you see, it does not matter where you've been. You can come back and do something to help others. So me being the chairman and the person of color is just showing others they can do it too. We also, our next meeting is August the 9th. I, as the chairperson, has decided that it's open to the community. Anybody who wants to come to speak out and talk, we, we are going to change that so that we do go to the newspaper and we're going to advertise that anyone is welcome to come to our meetings. We have to start with our county. We have to, like I said, get out. Talk to people, uh, for people to feel free to talk to us. Like we, you know, not close down or anything. And it's really, it's time for a new beginning. And like I said, with my committee, I just want the young ones. Because I do, I have a, granddaughter, a grandson, and he registered to vote. And even when there's a Democrat or any party, the young ones will tell you, our vote don't count. And we have to teach them that it does count. They have to understand no matter what, it does count. There are the next one to come up and everything do count. And we do have to start listening to them.